What's going on, you guys? Chasing here with another movie recommendation of the day. Today, I'm going back to the 90s with a much more fun action adventure. Um, you know, I love great action movies. They're not typically ones that I talk about often, but there are a few in there that I really, really love. And in 1993, uh, they made, you know, up there, easily probably top five, which tells the story of two gentlemen, one named Simon Phoenix, another John Spartan, and that film is called Demolition Man. Uh, Sylvester Stallone, Wesley Snipes in an action movie uh, that has become an iconic cult favorite. Um, you know, it's getting more and more popular. Uh, the San Diego Comic-Con, uh, either a couple years back, spoofed off this making Taco Bell, making a, a pop stand Taco Bell. Uh, let me get into it, what this movie's about first. Simon Phoenix is the most badass criminal in the 90s. John Spartan is the most badass cop who could only stop the most badass criminal in the 90s. However, after a crazy situation, Simon Phoenix is sentenced to be chronologically frozen as a crime. No more jails. They don't feed you. They don't let you sleep. They freeze you into a pit, and then you just stay there until your sentence is up. The incident leads John Spartan, the cop, Mr. Sylvester Stallone, to also be frozen. And then, all of a sudden, fast forward to 2032, Sandra Bullock is a cop. Rob Schneider is also a cop in a time when there is no violence, there's no interaction. We don't actually touch people anymore. So a lot of people have been saying this movie is very prevalent. <clears throat> the movie also meant, <laughs> way before it ever happened, mentioned Arnold Schwarzenegger getting into politics. It, you know, it, it, the iPad was in this before it was a thing. You know, not exactly, you know, of course. But all of these things, a lot of people say Demolition Man gets credit for. And one of the best things about the future is while you can't touch or interact with people, only one fast food chain won the restaurant wars, and it was Taco Bell. So every restaurant is now Taco Bell. Now, while all that seems funny and silly, this also is one of the best, most badass action movies uh of all time, seriously. So both of these guys get unfrozen uh, in 2032 when a time when violence is not a thing, when all of these uh, very common gunslinger type crimes would take place, don't. So the first place Simon Phoenix goes is to a museum to find a gun. And then all madness goes on afterwards. Dennis Leary's in this film. Just very, very good, very, very fun, classic 90s action sci-fi. Very, very cool. Um, very quotable movie, you'll laugh a ton, and it's just it's just a good time. Watch this with the family uh, one of these nights because it's one that you won't forget. And if you have seen it, good, it's time to rewatch it. Demolition Man, your movie pick of the day.